through me Hypnotized by the sounds I'm breathing in Hold tight, hold tight Can't make coast collide Hold tight, hold tight, hold tight Dripping lights paint the skies All because of you
run you through the fridge um, organization so this is what I have done so far um, and then I think we're going to start with the dough so at the bottom here I have a few drinks um, we prefer this go fruit mojito also it's very cheap I got each pack for 89 bob in Carrefour supermarket also we have the mala there and um, soy sauce next up we have a few yogurts for Ayana and then up here we have a few stacks of eggs a small stack of eggs and um, next to it I have this mayonnaise um, I prefer the Hanes creamy classic mayonnaise it's less odorful if that makes sense but this is my preference it's really really creamy so i really like this brand next here i have garlic syrup or garlic paste i don't know what you prefer to call it but i got this hack from this short lady that is really funny and loves to cook what's her name picana rich yes so i got this hack from picana rich this is how she said she stores her garlic so you just pound your garlic and then you put um a small amount of cooking oil in a jar and then you store it so every time you're cooking you just come in and scoop scoop your garlic and you're good to go so i basically recycled um this jam Halley's jam jar and um i've put my garlic there so if you didn't know that then that's a quick hack for you every time you're in a hurry just do your onions and then you take your garlic and you cook never to and then here i have my tomato paste tomato paste tomato paste <laughs> depends with your english teacher now let's get inside the fridge so over here i have my stack of milk for the whole week so this is our fresh milk for the whole week i still have a few space i'm going to be doing a meal prep and um, i think the video will be up tomorrow because it would be too long you know for you guys so i preferred to break it down into two fridge organization and a meal prep so you guys are going to be watching the meal prep video tomorrow so i still have a few spaces to fill um uh, with a uh, with the meal prep dishes so over here i have my milk here i have fruits apples and oranges is what i store in the fridge and then i have wrapped them in packs of three because we are a family of three so we have three there three there such that every time i take them out to cool i'll be taking a piece for each basically for each one of us and then here we have the fresh raspberries i got this from kafo i think i almost got everything from kafo except from these fruits so these ones are very cheap they are locally made i think they are 60 bob or 65 bob <laughs> i'm the only fan of raspberries so i just come and pick a few and eat nobody likes raspberries in this house only me so down here we have the um what is this called undiluted juice and then this is how i store my capsicum so every time i buy sweet corn i don't throw away um the what is this called this disposable plate so this is how i store my capsicum i don't i'm not a big fan of capsicum i basically use this for what is it called um i use this capsicum for vegetable rice yes so i'm not a big fan of cooking dishes with capsicum i really really do and then over here i have sweet corn which is also for for the vegetable rice so sweet corn going for 100 bob at kafo that whole pack down here i have stored my tomatoes here and this they're not mini i have a few tomatoes for the week and carrots as well i have stored them in these two um because i tend to buy them in bulk much and um i think this is the best way i can store them in the fridge in these two dishes so that's it for that and then at the bottom in the utility box or the crisper box i have all my greens green veggies green etc so over here i have spinach 
two stacks of spinach over here down here i have two stacks of terere and here i have my broccoli here is my broccoli ayana is a big fan of broccoli and then dania or coriander and this is parsley yeah yeah parsley or rosemary parsley or rosemary i think so so here is where i store all my vegetables like greens in short i store all my greens down here and then at least you know you can control the humidity so i like it i like to keep it at medium humidity control down here so that is it for the fridge area i hope you guys have gotten um the concept or an idea on how you can arrange yours so the 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 undiluted juice i think i'll have to squeeze it here if once i do the meal prep and the dishes are too many i'll have to squeeze it here and see what i can do yeah so um that's it for the bottom part and then now let's check out the freezer so this is my freezer it's not really really stocked but i do have um my cereals over here so these two stacks are green peas and then here i have the lentils no here i have the lentils and here i have the green grams at the center so i have not yet um boiled my njahe my black beans and my yellow beans i'll be doing that over the, the over the weekend right now um i don't have much time to do it so i'll be doing that over the weekend and i think if they'll be too much i'll have to stack them on top of each other but in the meantime that so that's it for the freezer i'm going to give you an update tomorrow after i do the meal prep so i think i'm going to be seeing you guys tomorrow for the meal prep and a few recipes for you all i hope you've been motivated and you have gotten a few tips on how to store your groceries and vegetables make sure you wrap you wrap them with cling film to ensure freshness they can stay like that for up to five days or a week and they are still very very fresh <laughs> no withering of the vegetables so um that is it guys i'm going to be seeing you tomorrow don't forget to subscribe i love you so much and don't forget that jesus loves you more bye i just wanna be happy happy